Today is June 6, 2022. Let's see what Robert Breedlove's price target is for Bitcoin by t end of 2023. At 307,000 by the end of 2021. In fact, you said by October of 2021. Now, again, I applaud you for giving us a target. I applaud anyone that comes on this show and actually sticks their neck out and gives a forecast. So what happened? Why didn't we get $307,000? Uh, dollars per Bitcoin by October of last year? <laughs> well, I can't answer what happened exactly. Um, and it's especially difficult when you put time to these things because that really throws things for a loop. But I can walk you through my thinking and what got me to that point was, and I just tweeted this out today too. In December, 2019, I put out a price prediction that said Bitcoin would hit 20,000 by December, 2020. And 240,000 by December 2023. The $20,000 price prediction by December 2020 was spot on. I think we, we exited the month at 24,000, maybe 25. And then by, I think it was, we recorded in May of 2020. So I think it was April of 2020. The model that I had was being outperformed by 100%. I think Bitcoin was like at 50K, the model had it at 24. Um, oh, the one other thing I left out here was I, I posted that prediction originally December 19, post March 2020, due to the central bank response, we revised that that peak price target from 240 to 307. So that was the 307 that I shared with you. Yeah. But the range was originally December 2021 to December 2023, that we'd hit 307,000 somewhere in that range. But when I came on your show and my model is being outperformed by 100%, I went with the uh, shorter term price or time prediction rather, and that was a definite miss. So, but as I'd like to say again, all models are wrong. Some are useful, most are dangerous. I don't, you know, I hope no one's trading options on this prediction, <laughs> thinking that it's going to come to fruition because none of us know, right? Anyone living right. by the crystal ball is bound to eat glass, but, but there's my logic nonetheless. <laughs> Another good saying you worked in there, Robert. I'm going to have to borrow many of these. But yeah. based on your model, you, it sounds like you still hold firm to the idea that we'll get 307,000 Bitcoin by the end of 2022? 2023. So my original range was December 2021 to December 2023. Because at the time, when I formulated the prediction originally, the cycles were getting slightly longer. These are the Bitcoin price cycles. Where we are now, it's hard to say. We may not even have Bitcoin price cycles anymore, or maybe they've been significantly elongated. Um, but yes, I think 307,000 before the end of December 2023 is very much in play. And do you have a price target for the end of 2022? Uh, I do not at this time, actually. the only That is the only model I've put together, and I've updated it post-COVID. And we've just been watching it to see how it does. Um, but I do regret not laying out the details behind this on our last recording, because now people are grilling me <laughs> for Bitcoin not hitting 300,000 by <laughs> well, October of 2021. <laughs> again, as I say, I respect any guest that comes on this show and has the fortitude to make a, a call that bold. And all right, so your model predicts 307,000 Bitcoin by 2023. With sometime within the next 24 months.